Dulwich Hamlet travel to Taunton Town this evening looking to end a series of four successive defeats. The uh, last defeat came on the road on Saturday as they went down by two goals to one at Weymouth. Akeem Rose scoring a double after Joel Powell had given us an early lead. The Hamlet have made two changes tonight with Frankie Raymond and Nana Owusu in for Ronnie Vint and Danny Mills. Taunton come into this game off the back of two very, very successful uh, victories, including a 3-0 win at Eastbourne at the weekend. 1L and Lucas come in for Grimes and Evans as they look to beat Hamlet on this ground for the second time this season. In swinging corner from this near side with that left boot of his. Thompson's wriggling, trying to get free of his markings towards the near post. Thompson does flick on. It's a goal kick. Got a very slight glance on that. that should be uh, a great achievement for them, of course. I think every fan around these parts would uh, take that at the start of the season. Left footed cross comes in, it's headed on. Or stern it was. Got a couple of goals in that win at Eastbourne at the weekend. Shot comes in from range. It's a long way off target, though. Speculative from that far side. Certainly not been a game to uh, warm someone up on a cold night here in Somerset. For the time being, it's very early days, though. Still more, uh, more about an hour to play still. More than. So Wusu goes in, chest that one down against 1L. And wants the return ball. He's onside of Wusu. It's a fine save by Bycroft. First time either side's had a shot on target. Stretching to his left to save as Felix sends another cross. Nodded down. Powell couldn't get his feet sorted. Quay Taylor goes long. And controlled. Send circle by Thompson. Now Odesanya. Odesanya on for Felix. Nice spot that. And Joe Felix asked to get forward by his manager in for Thompson. Slipping it on. Owusu's in. Stabs it goalwards. Good save. Owusu again. Pulls it back. And in. George Porter's there. Great finish from Porter from close range. Brilliant attack down the right-hand side from Dulwich Hamlet. And it's been rewarded with a goal. Bycroft did very well to deny Owusu. But the second attempt was finished by George Porter and he enjoyed that one the Dulwich 18 Dave Sims Burgess gets into the box Taylor blocks him off and the shot comes into the near post and it's into the side netting from Sims Burgess very close to a level up that's a good uh, understanding of clubs in the uh, National League South anyway Surging run forward from Smith and player on the outside. That sheds to the box. Chance for a leveller. Oh, I think it's hit the woodwork. On its way out. Shot potentially coming from range from Dulwich. And Bycroft gets down. It's Cam Thompson. Who hit it low from about 30 yards out? Here's uh, Joe Felix. Long ball forward. Looks for George Porter. Who chests it down. And trying to release Nana Owusu down the right hand side. It's a great spot that by Porter. Owusu does pick up possession up against 1L. Low cross. Looking for power. It's hammered away by Ball. Coming back though with Odesanya. Will Wood. Francis a shot from Rangewood. It's curving away from goal. Granger had to make a save at the other end and then pounce on the loose ball. Injury here to Frankie Raymond as uh, Taunton were allowed to continue. Zach Smith it's going to be. Deep looking ball. Or header clear. Jack Holland takes command of his penalty area and then tries to hook clear. It takes a deflection though. Falls from wide. And in by Zach Smith. There again. Stern crosses up in the air. Wood then clears. And the volley comes in from range just wide. It's at the post, in fact. 
Strikes the base of the post. Sims Burgess, centre of the park, would charge into a challenge, didn't get anywhere near it. Now Falston. Sims Burgess getting edge of the box, takes a deflection through. Is it 1 1? It's put wide. What a miss. What a miss from Stern. It was easy to score. James. Thought I could see the throw deep into their own territory. Cut back to the near post. It's got to be 1 1, it is. The goal has been coming. And Taunton Town have levelled. A nice cut back and finish into the roof of the net. And since the break, it's been one way traffic. Sims Burgess finishing high above Granger. It's given away though. Yeah, they come down the right with Lucas. Sort of wide by his own uh, lack of touch. Cross comes in by Lucas and tipped on. Off the crossbar. Felix hammers it clear. Not sure he got the touch in there, but about just in front of a play. Flicked it on. Rattles the woodwork. Deep looking ball. Gray just punched it. Two fists on it. As it comes back to this near side, Paulson will try and cross again. Felix trying to put him under pressure. Smith does get in across though as he was helping out Falston. Clearance to Morgan, edge of the box, clips it back in. Oh, what a save! Tremendous from Charlie Granger. Pure instinct to flick a volley over the bar. Batman tussles for the ball, can't come out on top. Deep cross coming in. Taylor heads that one clear under immense pressure. Shot comes in from range. Granger with a good save. Trying to win a corner. Throw instead. Five seconds to go. Of our minimum of five minutes added on. And one last cross to defend Dulwich. In it comes. Taylor gets it clear. And Danny Mills would have been played in, but it's uh, full time here. At uh, the Signet Healthcare Stadium, Dulwich have ended that sequence of four successive losses by getting a valuable point on the road. George Porter put them ahead in the 35th minute, finishing off a uh, cutback from Nana Rawusu from just a matter of two yards out. Torn to know the better side in the second half. They'd already hit the post and missed a big chance to Ross Stern before Dave Sims Burgess fired higher beyond Charlie Granger to level the game.